The overall goal of this method is to introduce the formation of loser and winner effects in Drosophila melanogaster by eliminating fly handling from the behavioral procedure. Um, most animal behavioral studies that are carried out in a laboratory setting involve handling of the animals. Handling of the animals, in turn, usually induces stress in the animals, and stress can interfere with the behavioral studies that you're trying to perform. To try to eliminate the stressful handling of animals, we developed a new chamber for our aggression studies in fruit flies that eliminates completely the handling of the animals prior, during, or after the experiments. Using these new chambers, all of the behavioral parameters that we've measured have turned out to be better. Using this method, we minimize the behavioral variability among individuals. We decrease the time necessary to generate clear dominance relationship, and we were able to induce a strong loser and winner mentalities. These chambers are easy to use and can be multi-purpose to study different fruit fly behaviors. To begin the experiment, raise and maintain fly stalks in a 12-hour light-dark cycle incubator at 25 degrees Celsius and 50% relative humidity. Next, prepare isolation vials by heating fresh fly food until it is melted. Using a Pasteur pipette, transfer approximately 1.5 milliliters of melted fly food into single empty glass test tubes and allow the food to solidify. With a fine paintbrush, gently remove a late-stage male pupa from the stock vial and place it on the side of a test tube containing freshly...